These three disks are the ABCs of the radioactivity in your daily life. The different radiations they give off are known by the first three letters of the Greek alphabet. Alpha is the radiation coming from polonium-210, a radioactive element discovered by Madame Curie in 1898. Atoms of the polonium-210 are spontaneously giving off alpha particles, which are entering the probe and triggering pulses of electricity inside. The current is amplified by the instrument. You can see the flow of current on the meter calibrated in counts per minute. Each burst of current makes a clicking sound come from the speaker. You've probably heard the instrument called a Geiger counter. Put a piece of paper between the polonium-210 and the probe. The current drops, showing the paper has blocked the alpha particles. Nuclear researchers have found that alpha radiation is made up of subatomic particles that can be stopped by such things as a sheet of paper, your skin, and other relatively thin materials, such as air. Beta, the second Greek letter, is the name given to the radiation coming from strontium-90, an element chemically similar to calcium. The betas are also picked up by the probe and register a little less than 200 counts per minute on the meter. The paper that stopped the alphas has little effect on the betas. They go right through it. Research has shown that betas are also subatomic particles, but have more penetrating power than alphas. Now put a three-quarter inch thick piece of wood in the path of the betas. The wood absorbs most of the betas. Beta particles are stopped by such barriers as wood, thin sheets of metal, walls, and many other materials. And finally, the third kind of radiation. You may have heard of cobalt-60 in connection with cancer treatment. The atoms of cobalt-60 give off beta particles and a different kind of radiation called gamma, the third letter of the Greek alphabet. The combination of betas and gammas results in 300 to 400 counts per minute. Bring in the same paper. The radiation from cobalt-60 goes right through it. wood. The cobalt-60 betas are absorbed by it, just as the betas from strontium-90 were. Now you're measuring only gamma radiation. This is a one-inch thick barrier of lead sheets. Most of the gammas are absorbed by the lead, as the meter shows. Almost all of the radioactivity in your everyday life is made up of these three kinds of radiation. Alpha particles, which are stopped rather easily, beta particles, which have moderate penetrating power, and the highly penetrating gamma, 